welcome back to Houston because you are a Houston girl, Kendra yeah. Scott. And a lot of people don't know you graduated Fine high school. Go Bearcats. Yeah, girl. Yeah. I love it. <laughs> a lot of people don't know that. Of course, we think Austin girl, which is still true. Yes. But your heart is here. My heart's in Houston. I just love this community so much. And this, you know, this community really like I came here when I was 16 years old, graduated from high school here. It's such a wonderful city. It's a vibrant city. And I love coming back and to launch my charms collection here in my hometown. Nothing could be better. And congratulations to you because you have grown truly into a household name. Everybody knows Kendra Scott. Everybody wants to wear Kendra Scott. And by the way, can I just talk to you about this necklace? Yeah. Um, this is the very first Kendra Scott piece that I purchased before you even had a boutique. Yes, yes. I, you walked in and I was like, I love that piece. It's so beautiful. And it's so fun because we have collectors. I mean, I've been doing this since 2002. So 16 years. I started out of my extra bedroom. Now we have 80 stores across the country and you know it's crazy and I see vintage pieces like that it makes me so excited and I wish I had it because I don't it's well, beautiful you can borrow it okay thanks yeah thanks. consider it um, but take me back to the beginning days when you were literally peddling trying to get somebody to buy your earrings right yeah you know I had my little baby son in a baby carrier I did my first collection in a jewelry in a tea box a wooden tea box and I went store to store in Austin to try to sell my product and that was 16 years ago and you know, over the years, it's been a slow build. I did it all on lines of credit and, you know, taking my kids in tow with me and building a team of amazing, amazing people. Uh, we have over 2,000 employees now in Kendra Scott. Over 95% are amazing women. Um, and we've just built something that, you know, we're all really, really proud of. When did you know that you made it, that you became a household name? I don't know if I know, if I know that yet. <laughs> Girl, you have made it. You know, I, I just feel like there's so much yet we have to do, and I'm so excited. I, you know, I'm so excited for the future of Kendra Scott. I'm giddy. I wake up every morning, and I can't wait to go to work. And I think that we, this is just the beginning for our brand, and I'm excited to see where it goes. And talk to us about the Charm Collection, because it seems like a natural fit for you. It's so beautiful. How long have you been thinking about this? So this has been about two years in the making, and it was really out of that need to have that continued personal personalization for our customer. When you come into a Kendra Scott store, you consider a color bar and customize your jewelry. We thought what a great way for her to continue that through charms and to tell her story in her own style, in her own way. And the charm collection really does that. And it incorporates color bars. So you can pick healing stones and burst stones to mix in with your charms. And I think, you know, I'm going to be really excited to see the customers next week when it launches, coming in and playing and having fun and really telling us and sharing with us what's important to her. Well, I, I think it's great that you're still evolving, you're still blooming, and that you're growing. I walk down the street all the time and I see, oh, I have those Kendra earrings, I have that oh, necklace. So it's you. so wonderful to see that you really did. You had a vision, you built it from the ground up, and you're still out there. You're still involved in the company. Yeah, very. Yeah. Um, you know, I'm CEO, I'm the head designer, I'm the majority shareholder, um, and it's, you know, I love it. I love it, absolutely love it. And I love what we're doing for our community. I mean, you know, when I started, I decided if anybody would call me, I would never turn anyone away, that I would always have something to give. 16 years later, we have still done that. Last year, we gave over four and a half million dollars to women's and children's charities, 25,000 pieces of jewelry. Uh, so we've really, you know, we, we just love what we're able to do. And you did a great thing for our um, family members and friends in, in Santa Fe after yeah. that horrific tragedy and that necklace. So many people wear that proudly. Absolutely. I mean, what that community went through, we're glad that we can, you know, have these moments with these people during tough times and bring a little bit of joy and happiness to them. So. Okay, you ready to have some fun? Oh, no. It's a little something we like okay. to call at Houston Life rapid fire. Okay. You ready? I'm ready. Okay. Okay. Okay, let's go. Whataburger or In N Out? In N Out. Ooh, Tex Mex or barbecue? Tex Mex. Aggies or Longhorns? Longhorns. Mm -hmm. Beer or wine? Wine. <laughs> Rose. <laughs> Ooh. To be specific. Okay, love it. Earrings or bracelet? All of the above. Oh, okay. Are you a little bit country or a little bit rock and roll? Oh, I'm definitely country and rock and roll. Can I be both? <laughs> Okay, I guess. I we'll mean, is you... it okay? To it's pick... okay. Because I like it both. I like them both. Okay, I do okay, too. Okay. okay, last one. You got to pick one. Okay, now. okay, okay, okay. Cowboy boots or heels? Heels. Yeah, girl. <laughs> Congratulations. Thank we love you having you in Houston. Thank you so much. Thank you.